Hey guys, Zach back here for a, another video. And today I'm gonna be kind of doing something a little bit different. Not really, it's still kind of car involved, but it's not actually working on a car. I'm gonna be repurposing my wife's old Jeep grill. And in my last video, you saw I changed out the headlights. And uh, a few videos ago, actually close to one of my first, I changed out her grill. So I've had this grill just sitting in the garage. Thought about selling it, not really sure. Then my wife, wanted a jeep grill thing to hang on the wall lights up you know kind of looks like the front end of a jeep so it gave me an idea and now that i have the headlights i still have to get these little corner lights but that won't be hard to add later i'm gonna do it as a valentine's day present i've got lights that's gonna go around the jeep and kind of light up the back because it's gonna hang on the wall so it's gonna light up the back light up the the air inlets and all that and then i'm gonna try to put them inside the headlights like in the holes and kind of make them light up a different color too. And then when I get the, uh, try to find some side markers, I might be replacing hers. So I might just use the ones off that I pull off her Jeep. Either way, I'm gonna try to make that work. Uh, and I'm gonna show you guys how to do that or how I'm gonna do it. I'm sure there's a whole bunch of different ways you can do however you want to, but I'm just gonna show you how I'm gonna do it and the finished product. So I actually gotta go check the mail and see if what I bought even came in. So I'm gonna run out and go do that right now, and I'll be back. Haha, <laughs> big that sound. Get back inside. It is super cold out here. All right guys, so I'm on my way back into the house now. It is freezing out here. It's probably not as cold to all you up north, but I think it's like in the high 20s. Now, I know all you people up north are like, well, that's not that bad, but I'm from Tennessee. It's bad for me, but so I'm gonna open this up, show you what I got. Uh, I'll leave a link in the description for that. Everything else I've just kind of had, so there's really no links for all that stuff. But I'm gonna open that up, show you what I got. All right, so what I picked up is just these um, uh, RGB LED strip light. You can just use it for kind of whatever, but what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna hot glue them to the back of this. And uh, I think it's this, I think it's 16 feet is what it said. Um, but I think this will work for what I'm trying to do. But before I start putting any of this together, my wife's got to get home with my hot glue gun that she doesn't know that I'm what I'm using it for. But I've got to clean all this up because as you see, she's got the winch where the winch was. We can never wash it. So it's all kind of a little chewed up and all dirty in the headlights. I just took those off, so they're, they're a little dirty from outside, salt on the roads and everything. So I'm gonna go try to clean these up and uh, I'll be back. All right, so I got this cleaned up about as good as I can. So I'm gonna start putting all this together. Uh, I use the old brackets from the headlights because I replaced them too. And uh, I'm just gonna hot glue these into the brackets and then uh, probably hot glue the bracket to the actual back of the grill so I'll get to doing that and I'll show you if it works or if I fail all right guys so as you can see it's it's done now my original plan to mount it using the headlight brackets didn't end up working out i ran out hot glue and then i tried super glue them and it just they weren't sticking so what i ended up doing is just getting a box i had the black box that the headlights came in and i just cut out big enough to go to this outer ring and then small enough to fit this inner ring right here where the um the metal ring would go in and just uh gorilla glued it to that and it's I let it sit overnight and it, they're in there. They're not going anywhere. Did the same thing over there. And then the lights, I started them. I kind of kinked them up like that. I have that there because I'm going to put these lights in there at some point. But I kinked them up like that and just shoved them in there. So that way when you turn them on, the headlights light up. And I just got it wrapped around all up there into that one. Down there enough space for that light. I had to wrap it all the way back here for that light. Bring it up, kind of double back that way to make it come down in the middle. So that way it looks fine when it's hanging on the wall. It's not lopsided or whatever. So 
I mean, that's that's basically it. Kind of wish I could have gone more in depth with you, but I was getting a little irritated because it it's a pain. But that's it. The uh, LED lights I got, I'll leave a link in the description below. They come with this little remote, so you can turn it on, change different colors, or have it do that. I'm not exactly sure what that does. I think it just flickers and changes to different things, but it looks great. The back of it isn't that pretty, but the front of it, that's what you're gonna be looking at anyways. I was worried about how to mount it to the wall. If you look, you see the holes where the, uh, the tabs went in and the grill. All I'm gonna do is just probably just put some hooks in there or something and then screw it into the wall. I mean, that's it guys. If you want to repurpose your Jeep grill and make kind of like wall art out of it. I mean, that's really all there is to it. It'll look a lot better once I get the side marker lights in there, but pretty excited to get it on the wall. But that's it for today's video. Just kind of showing you that. I figured it'd be cool for you guys to want to see. I know I've seen it a lot of places and people want to know how to make them. So, that's it. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. Any questions about what I did here, just let me know in the comments and I'll answer it the best I can. But thanks for watching. Hope you liked the video and until next time.